All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to this video. Um, today's Sunday. Uh, it's February 5th today, Sunday, and uh, I'm just heading to the climbing gym right now to meet up with some friends. It's 11.20. Um, got a little bit of a later start to the day, but that's just how Sunday goes for me usually. Uh, my friend's supposed to be going to the Chrome Heart store um, in like West Hollywood on Robertson later today. So I think I might just join him on his appointment because I never go to the Chrome Heart store. I don't really uh, bother too much to go there. But uh, if my friend made an appointment, I might as well just join him. Yeah, I'm gonna try to climb a little bit real quick and then get some food and then I'll either go to my friend's house or I'll meet him at the store maybe, which might be a little bit of a hassle. It would be easier just to carpool, so hopefully I can make it in time to his house. But yeah, I have some uh, things that I've gone recently that I just wanted to share. Um, in this video also, so I thought it'd be a good time to make a video. Uh, one of them is just this jacket that I'm wearing, so I don't want to show too much of it. But uh, I'm super stoked on this jacket. I mentioned it in a previous video, and I've been rocking it quite a bit the past few days now that I have it. So I'm psyched to uh, kind of break it in. Thanks for watching, and I uh, hope you all enjoy the rest of the video. All right, I have an update. Um, I drove like 10 minutes down the road towards the freeway, and I realized I forgot my climbing shoes. Um, so I usually just keep them in my truck, but I've been taking them out recently, so um, yeah, I forgot them, so I gotta head back home to get those. So I think now, I don't know if I'm gonna make it to my friend's Chrome Parts appointment, but we'll see. Um, if not, I'll just go kind of hang out somewhere else and check some stores out. Also, I want to say that it's sweet that um, people are like asking a lot of questions in the comments or like DMing me on Instagram with questions about I don't know, just like clothing or anything in general. And uh, yeah, I enjoy that, that's cool. Like it's, it's sweet that um, my videos are able to kind of spark a little bit of conversation or if you just want to ask a question, um, always feel free to reach out and I'll uh, get to your questions usually pretty quickly. And uh, yeah, if you ever want to just ask about anything, really, um, I don't mind at all. All right, what's up everyone? Um, I just finished climbing, I climbed for like an hour and a half. But uh, I was climbing at like a climbing gym, uh, not the one that I usually go to. So now I'm meeting my friend in uh, downtown LA so I can leave my truck here and then he's gonna drive from here to, uh, to the Chrome Heart store. But we're just gonna pull up a little bit late because I think his appointment was at two and it's already 2.10. So we'll probably be there like 2.45, three. Um, I don't think it matters too much. Hopefully not, that would be kind of whack. Um, but then again, like if you have an appointment at the time, you should probably be there at the time. But um, yeah, we'll try to roll on through there and hopefully we go in, I don't know. Most of the time you can't really film, but I might try to film a little bit if I can. My friend just dropped me back off at my uh, car, and so I'm driving home now. I actually ended up getting a t-shirt um, from the Chrome Art store. Uh, usually, I feel like now it's pretty empty with a lot of stuff they have, especially jewelry and t-shirts. Um, they had like the leather Converse there today, which is kind of cool to see, but uh, I don't even bother asking the price on those because I know it's just going to be ridiculous. Um, but yeah, I'm stoked on the tea. I'll show you guys when I get home. Um, at the end of the day, the prices at Chrome Mars are just like insane, but I don't know. Sometimes you just feel like getting something when you're there. What's up everyone? Just wanted to end off the video showing a few things I've gotten recently. Um, there's this one jacket I'm super hyped on that I'll show now, but I think I'm gonna make like an entire video for it. So I have like a few tees and stuff that I wanted to show, and then something I got from Chrome Mars today. All right, so first off, um, I'm just gonna show some of the tees that I've gone recently. Um, they're mainly just vintage tees. And the first one is this Jimi Hendrix tee. 
that uh, I've been looking for for quite a while now, but never really pulled the trigger because the prices were insane. Uh, this graphic on the front is super sweet. It's on a Hanes Ultraweight. Um, this one's an XL, and then the back graphic is super sweet also. I love this one. Next one is just a random one that um, I'm stoked on just to like work out in or anything. Um, but it's just this black tee with like a v-neck and then on the side there's like a little bit of a longer sleeve and both sides just have this like Raiders logo which is kind of funny. Um, yeah so this one might fit me a little small but that might work out for uh, for a little bit of a sweeter fit. Next one that I'm actually really hyped on, um, I've never like seen this tee and it's definitely not that common but it's basically just an old Kid Rock tee with this funny with this funny font at the front and then the back um, just says that. I don't know if I should read it out. I don't know if YouTube would um, give me a strike or something. I don't really know how it works, but yeah, the back is super tight. And then the last vintage thing I got is just this funny old tank top that I thought was going to be small on me, but actually fits kind of like a, like a wife pleaser. So yeah, I'm stoked on this one. I actually wore this one already and um, I have to kind of use this during the summer. Once uh, it gets hotter, I'm definitely gonna use this so I can get a little bit of a tan on my shoulders. All right, um, and then the tea I got from the Chrome Heart store today. It's just this sweet white one um, with a pocket and then the back has the same graphic that's on this pocket here. So um, the back just has this huge print. Um, just got like the triple cross, just says Chrome Hearts Hollywood. It's like the white and the orange, they go well together. And uh, thought I'd get a white tee since I never really rock like white tees. And this one's super sweet. The last thing that I wanted to show is just this Telson N1 deck jacket that I've been talking about in my previous video. And it's made out of a black um, Japanese salvage deck. This is the jacket. I'll throw some photos up um, that I find online so you can kind of see it a little bit better. But um, it's just a super solid, sturdy denim on the outside, which I personally liked because a lot of the um, deck jackets that you see on the market are like a uh, whip cord or something like that, like a canvasy material. I like that it's denim and it's super rough so I can kind of break this in and it'll kind of get this own look to it. Inside is just uh, Sherpa lined and then the arms are quilted. Um, I'm super stoked on this. Also another thing that's cool with this one is that the collar is a little bit smaller than um, most N1 jackets and that that's because this is like a collaboration with Todd Blueball who's like a I don't know exactly what he is like a photographer or something but he makes like really sweet motorcycle podcast videos on YouTube that I'll um, link in the description but yeah this is like a collab with him and so the collar is a little bit smaller which I assume is for when you're riding with your helmet on so it doesn't like cut into your helmet too much super stoked on this um, it's just like a classic jacket I've been looking at N1s for a while now, but a lot of them I wasn't like too sure about. But I was stoked on this one just because it's a black denim and you can kind of break it in and it'll have like a sweet look once you've worn it a ton. The last thing that I wanted to show is um, a solid cologne. And um, this is a Diptyque solid cologne. Um, I think this is the Orpheon scent. Um, I'm honestly not sure what scent it is, but I'm pretty sure that's the name because it says it on the back here. But this one smells super sweet and you basically just open it like that and it looks like a little um, makeup thing and you can either take some with your finger and like wipe it on your neck or you just like wipe this whole thing on your neck which also works and it's sweet because you can just kind of slip this into your pocket if you want to carry it around with you and uh, it's nice to just switch it up from a liquid fragrance I don't know this is my first solid fragrance so so far I've been liking it a lot and I feel like the scent lasts longer than when you spray on a fragrance um, but yeah, this is sweet because it's like a little thing. Just throw it in your wallet or something and uh, carry it around. All right, that's um, basically it for this video. I just wanted to share some stuff from today and uh, some like my recent pickups. Um, I should be heading to San Francisco, not next weekend, but the weekend after that. And yeah, I'm super hyped for that. Um, it's nice to go to San Francisco. I love San Francisco. But um, yeah, if you've been enjoying my videos, I'm super hyped that uh, people are liking them and leaving me comments and questions and stuff like that on Instagram and in the comments of my videos. I'm really, I think that's really awesome. But yeah, if you've been enjoying my videos, uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe so you can uh, continue watching my videos.